Uh, we're about to get going here. You guys start on Monday. So what's it like getting going up at Fremont? Um, we've been having a lot of open gyms, getting ready. Not very many seniors have showed up because of volleyball. That's kind of gotten the way, but I think we're going to get ready right on Monday. So. Uh, obviously with a small school, how tough is it to, to get going right as the season gets going? Um, with the small school, we obviously don't have very many people that show up to open gyms, so it's kind of hard to get everybody there. And But we've been playing together since second grade, so I think we'll be really good this year. What's the identity, Fremont team? What do you mean by that? Like, What's the style of play? What do you guys want to um, be known for this year? Um, we usually are known for our 1-2-2 two, two or fast break, and we like to get moving down the court fast, so... Yeah, that's about it. Uh, what are the goals for this Fremont team this year? Um, we're going to try and win NECC. We're going to try and win sectionals this year. Hopefully we're favored to win our sectional this year and then just keep going on. We have a pretty good chance at winning state this year. So, uh, What do you need to do now that will translate into those, those February, those March months? Um, definitely we need to work harder in practice. That's a big thing. So. Obviously, you guys start on Monday, so kind of what's it like getting going and what do you want to see out of your team right out of the gate? I just want to see them working hard and, you know, we got a bunch of girls in volleyball and, you know, we don't know where they're going to end up in the sectional. So just hoping to see as many kids as we can see on Monday and, and then go from there. You know, we scrimmage on the 2nd of November DeKalb yeah. and then we play East Side on the 8th. So, uh, What's the identity of this team going to be this year? I think in your face defense and, and try to turn you over and, and then push the ball whenever possible. Uh, she was talking about how the goals, how obviously conferences are there, sectional is there. Kind of how do you list the goals and, and where, what are they in particular? Well, we're going to we, – section or not sectional, uh, conference is what I put first. And I'll take one game at a time and see where we end up at the end of the year. But we have eight seniors, so we're, we're hoping we can have a pretty good season. So, How much does that experience help as a coach? Oh, it helps a lot. Uh, I will find out after we lose eight seniors what, what's going to happen, but I think it's, re it's really going to be helpful. They've been playing together all, you know, all along and had really good records through I'm coming from middle school all the way into high school. Uh, how do you balance it with uh, being a small school like Fremont? Obviously, you got a bunch of girls playing volleyball. How do you balance it with making sure they're they're in the basketball spirit, but they're also competing for volleyball as well? Yeah, we're pretty good with sharing our athletes, you know. Uh, just kind of leave them alone while they're in the other sport. And then as soon as that sport's over, you get a hold of them. So all the coaches really buy into sharing the athletes. So that's pretty good. 